So anyway, y'all. What? You're making all the noise? How about I come over there and open up a can of whoop it? On the radiator grill. And she don't like it. Rock the cat box. Rock the cat box. What? The sheep don't like it. Rock the cat box. Sharif don't like it. Rock the casbah. I'm making this video because I like to tinker with my kayak. You want to make something of it? Yeah, I didn't think so. Hey, I'm Steve with Adventure Outdoors, and today I'm making a video about my kayak anchor. Yeah, I like to tinker, and my kayak anchor, I'm just, just trying to fine tune it and really find a system that I like. And I've made other videos about the kayak anchor system on my kayak, and I think if you'll check those out, I'll put some links you will find some good ideas. But I came across another video not too long ago with yet another idea about how to modify my kayak anchor and I wanna show you my new system today, all right? All right, with this new system, what you do is you take a sledgehammer and you take some string, and you wrap it around. I'm just kidding, that's not really it. Okay, y'all, here is my latest and greatest kayak anchor system. Now, I have combined pieces of the old system, the anchor, the float, the um, clip, but what I've added is this right here in the middle, and what this actually is, is a scuba diving reel. Not exactly sure what the scuba divers use it for, but I think they may send up balloons and things like that. It's a real, it's a really neat little gadget. And it comes with string, heavy duty type string. But what I did is I replaced that with my own cordage right here. But the system and being able to turn this knob and reel the cord back onto this reel and use it easily with my anchor trolley I've used it so far it works perfect as of right now this is probably going to be my new go-to kayak anchor system now I think one of the reasons that I like this system so much is because it is simple like me I'm a simple man I have tied my anchor on I have spooled the reel and you can deploy your line easily by depressing the uh, latch right here so you depress it and your line will deploy okay and when you let go as you can see there are notches in there and this little plastic uh, piece right here will catch and lock itself in so it's easy to deploy the anchor to whatever length that you want and you basically this is going to be attached to your anchor trolley ring okay you're going to throw the whole thing after you deploy however much anchor line you want this is attached to your anchor ring you're going to throw the whole thing in the water and then you'll adjust your anchor trolley to uh position your kayak and when you're done you simply reel it all back in it's all it all stays compact really simple stuff stays together you don't have a bunch of line going anywhere and tangling up and getting fouled and your other stuff in the kayak because any of y'all that kayak fish knows that fishing line cord anything will catch on the tiniest little thing and it will catch and it will aggravate the crap out of you Isn't that cool? Okay, somebody will ask me about this float and what that is there for is if you have to unhook your anchor and throw it away to either you're in a dangerous situation or you're going off to fight a fish, this 
float will float all of this and you can come back and get it okay just hook it up to your anchor trolley ring and you can deploy it however you want to and like I said all of this you just throw the whole bit of that in the water Just deploy it. Uh, of course, it's not in the water. It's not going to retrieve as easily through the grass. But you get the idea, and you just throw the whole thing in the water, and then adjust your anchor trolley. When you're done, unhook it. You've got a nice little compact package. Drop it in your milk crate behind you. I showed you in a previous video how you can easily make this anchor holder out of PVC and it works on any kayak. So a great way to store your anchor would also be just to drop it in there and like so and you've got a nice neat setup go to your next spot drop anchor no muss no fuss i think i'm really going to like this system so this is the scuba max dive reel with thumb stopper yep that's what it says scuba max dive reel with thumb stopper as of the making of this video it's $24 I'll put a link in the description you know there's probably other things you can think of that you could use a reel like this but I think I'm gonna like it so yeah hey if you try this let me know in the comments come back to me and say hey Steve that was awesome or hey Steve that sucked all right Okay, I don't think you're going to think it sucks. Okay, I'm Steve. That's it. I'll see you next time. I'll be back. <laughs> Good Lord, that was dumb.